Hello, Curious, and welcome back. Where the family life of two and a half men star Charlie Sheen is concerned, it is just as explosive and talked about some of the things that he has done himself. And while the actor often made headlines himself, it looks like his 17-year-old daughter Sammy has decided to follow in her father's footsteps. Everyone has been talking about the teen ever since she posted a TikTok video claiming that a year ago she was trapped in an abusive household and that she was depressed, among other things. And that had the internet in an uproar trying to figure out what the situation was. And who did Sammy live with previously? And what caused her to leave? What is Charlie's relationship with his daughter that he shares with Denise Richards? And what has been happening with his twin sons while their mother was in rehab? And who is Sheen's oldest daughter. Stay with us until the very end to find out all the latest information, but before we continue, don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel. Some could say that an apple doesn't fall too far from the tree when it comes to making headlines within the Sheen family, and this is all too true for Charlie and his daughter Sammy, whom he shares with Denise Richards. The 17-year-old has recently posted a TikTok video, which has since been deleted, in which she claimed that she has moved out of an abusive household. She also claimed that a year ago she had also hated herself and would go days without eating or sleeping and that she was depressed, but now things were better as she moved out and was full of self-love. As Page Six has reported once the video went viral, although she never specified which parents she was living with, a source told the publication that last year she was living with her mother. And as per the site, they also pointed out that in July the teen shared a video saying that her mom tried to kick her out of her home. But the source went on to add that these claims are just simply untrue and a product of teenage angst. You know, allegedly, Denise has set a normal rule that any parent would be setting, and one that 17-year-olds did not want to follow. Charlie Sheen, on the other hand, who has different ways of parenting than his ex-wife has recently spoken up about the issue involving his daughter that everyone was trying to find out what was going on, and in a statement released to Us Weekly, the platoon actor confirmed that his daughter moved out of Richards' house and that is currently she's living with him. And in a statement, he also said, Sam's amazing. I love her and all my children unconditionally. We're all having a ball. GED, here we come. And in the end, most likely referring to the alternative of a high school diploma and thus helping his daughter further education after she ended up dropping out of high school. As some of you might know, Sheen and Denise Richards were previously married between 2002 and 2006, and their daughter Sam, who was born on March 9th of 2004, and a year later on June 1st of 2005, they welcomed their second daughter, Lolo. And while the Real Housewives of Beverly Hills defended Charlie in the past, stating that at the start of their marriage he was sober, that changed by the time she was pregnant with Lolo, where she revealed for her it was a dark and toxic time, which led her to file for divorce when she was six months pregnant. And once the two separated in 2011, she adopted her daughter, Alois and in 2018, she married a sound and light therapist, Aaron Fipers. And if you want to know more about celebrities who had issues with their children, you can do so by checking out our previous video, like Robert Downey and his son, by clicking on the link above. But for now, make sure to stay with us until the very end. During seasons 9 and 10 of Real Housewives of Beverly Hills, Bravo viewers got a chance to catch a glimpse of the relationship that Denise had with her kids and what she had to say about her ex's use of illicit substances and affected the constant headline-making behavior affected the girls. And speaking on the show in an episode that aired in 2020, she said that she was struggling with parents her teenagers, claiming that her daughter Sammy did certain things just to get a reaction out of her and that was not easy. But she also revealed that many people had a misconception about Charlie, and a lot of people have an impression of me being wild and crazy, but Charlie was sober when we got married, so we were not this swinging couple that people might assume. But when things got dark to protect her daughter, she had to get out of that marriage, and while she did whatever she could to hide his behavior from the girls. But as the girls were growing up, the two had made their, their priority for both of them to be present in their lives, such as having family dinners at least once a week. And a source close to the family had spoken with Hollywood Life had said that Charlie is very close with his two younger daughters, and he tries to see them at least once a week at his house, and that he is more protective over them than his other two children. And speaking of his other kids, some of you might remember a brief while that Richards was looking after Sheen's son from his third marriage. So what's that all about? Stay with us as we're going to tell you more in just a moment. The Arrival star's third marriage was to actress Brooke Mueller, and the two tied the knot in 2008 but ended up getting a divorce in 2011 after Charlie was arrested for domestic violence charges, which stemmed from the altercation between the two of them that they had. Though, while they were still together, the pair welcomed twin sons, Bob and Max, on March 14th of 2009. And here it's worth pointing out that while the Two and a Half Men star's problems with illicit substances are well known, so are the problems of his ex-wife who, prior to the two of them getting together, already had been in rehab, but that wouldn't have been the end of her problems. Because in May of 2013, two years after the married couple divorced, child services had removed the then four-year-old children from Mueller's care. 
and when her suspected continued use of illegal substances made the house an unsafe place for the small children, soon after that, Brooke entered rehab while their sons were initially placed in the care of Denise Richards, as their father was dealing with his own problems, as the actress revealed, and later moved to the care of Muller's brother, Scott. But that wouldn't be the end of the boys moving around, because by December of that following year, the boy's mother had full custody granted back to her by the court. And once again, fast forward a year, and in November of 2016, police had launched a search for Muller and her two sons in Salt Lake City, where she later turned up barefoot into a bar in the morning of November 16th with her two sons and a nanny, from where she was taken to the hospital for an evaluation. And once again, she ended up in a relapse, and fans couldn't help but point out that this had happened just as Sheen was starting to have issues while not being able to pay child support. And since we're on the topic of children of celebrities, why don't you check out our playlist dedicated to just that topic? And you can do so by clicking on the link above. Through his messy divorces, the actor had to pay both of his ex-wives, Denise and Brooke, over $110,000 per month, which came to nearly $3 million a year. But in 2016, he started having issues as he was not getting enough income to be able to support these payments, which was later confirmed by Richards. Though for now, let's get back to Mueller, as this was not the end of these struggles. And after she got out of rehab for the upteenth time, things seemed to be going a little bit better for the world according to Paris Star, but in 2019, a video of her using illicit substances had surfaced on Online, and in response to this, she had voluntarily entered a rehabilitation center in an effort to deal with her problems. This time, the twins, Max and Bob, who in their 12 years had already been through a lot, ended up in the care of Brooke's parents. And as of making this video, there have not been many updates as to what has been happening to Brooke and whether she is still in rehab, but fans noticed that it does not look like Charlie had any plans to seek custody, though upon her entering the facility in 2019, the actor spoke with the blast about the issue. Between myself and the boys' two amazing set of grandparents, we continue to seamlessly love, shelter, and protect Bob and Max from the haphazard choices and unsightly behavior their mom refused uses to extinguish once and for all. These wonderful boys need their mom, and hopefully one day soon they will finally have one. Until then, on every front, we got this. A source close to the actor also revealed that he does see his sons despite not having custody on them. And while many scandals have surrounded Sheen and his youngest children, to some it comes as a surprise to learn that he also has a 36-year-old daughter, Cassandra Jade Estevez, who was born on December 12th of 1984 when the actor was 19. Her mother was in high school, a sweetheart, Paula Prophet, though at times her name was reported as Paula Spirit, and Charlie's oldest daughter has had a rather quiet life, marrying her own high school sweetheart with whom she welcomed a daughter, Luna. And for the most part, Cassandra has stayed out of the spotlight, and the actor rarely spoke about her in interviews. And one of the few times he did it was in 2013, when he said that he was nervous to become a grandfather. However, it is clear to see that he enjoys playing his part in the past and has often shared photos of little Luna to his Instagram. Although media reports suggest that the two might have not had the closest bond, Sheen was there during the most important days of her life, which also included her wedding, where he walked her down the aisle. And Charlie was also very supportive of her desire to pursue acting, attending her shows at the Loyola Marymount University in Los Angeles, where she studied. And Cassandra did once speak about her father to the press when, in an interview with E! News, she told reporters that she loved her dad, and that was all that she could say right now, and adding that now is not the time for her to come forward, but that someday she will. So curious, what are your thoughts on the Sheen's family life and his relationship with his children. Do you know the things his twin sons had to go through? And what do you think his oldest daughter might reveal one day? And do you think Sam's TikTok was just her acting out, or is there more that we don't know about? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below, and as always, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Until next time!